Hello everyone and welcome to the FCFT. Now I've been asked how to export audio from Final Cut to an MP3 file. Now it's simple enough if you have Final Cut Studio where you can send it to Soundtrack Pro. But when dealing with Final Cut Express, that's not an option. So today I'm going to be doing something unique and using not only Final Cut, but iTunes. So why don't we begin? Now, I already have the project in my timeline that I want to turn into an MP3 file. This could be useful if you're planning to turn a new segment into a podcast. So to do this, I'm going to go up to File, Export, and select QuickTime Movie. From here, a new window will open. Now, name your file and make sure to change the drop-down from Video and Audio to Audio Only. Once that's complete, let's select a location to save our file. In this case, I'm just going to select Desktop and let's save. After Final Cut completes, let's take a look at our desktop. So we can see now that we have our file, but it's still that .mov file extension, which is a video file extension. So let's right click this file and open with iTunes. Now that iTunes is loaded, our file starts to play. Just close this window for now. Before we do anything, let's set up our iTunes so that we can convert the file to MP3. Go to the iTunes menu and select Preferences. In this new page, you'll see a button called Import Settings. Let's click this button. Here is where we can change what file format we want to convert to. If you drop down this menu, we can see MP3, WAV, AIFF, AAC, and a few more options. Let's just select MP3. Hit OK and OK again to go back to the iTunes library. Now, please note, you will only have to set the preferences up once. So next time you need to convert audio, you can skip that step. And now that we are back to our iTunes library, let's find our file. Let's search our file name and hit Enter. Now that we found the file, let's select it. Go to File, Create New Version, and where it says Create MP3 Version, hold the Option button and it will change it to Convert. Click Convert MP3 Version and a pop-up will appear asking where to convert to. I'm just going to click Desktop and then hit Open. It will take a little bit of time depending on how big your file is, but before you know it, it will be ready. Now we have our audio as an MP3, so I'm just going to do a little bit of cleanup and delete the track in our iTunes library. And there you have it, you now have the audio file from Final Cut switched to an MP3. And thank you for joining me on this FCFD. If you'd like to learn more, visit mcm11.org.